y'all it's Christy from homes and things and in today's video we are going to tour the five bedroom two bath monster mansion that's right we're touring the monster mansion today we're out here at Wayne Fryer homes in Albany Georgia and I can't wait to show it to you so let's get into the video Again, you guys, this is the Monster Mansion, five bedroom, three bath home, beautiful home. When you enter the home, you are in the living room. This would be more like a formal living room for me. Uh, this isn't a place that I would have a TV or have company um, or a family just lounging around. This would be more like a formal space, a space that stay, stay put together. It has two transom windows in here, bringing in lots of natural light. Love the wood trim around the um, top and bottom of the um, walls just a beautiful area enough room to put whatever furniture um, I would like in here but I wouldn't have this be like a space for a TV or anything like that but beautiful space you have a ceiling fan in this area which is always nice and it's right off the kitchen now the kitchen cabinets are absolutely beautiful I personally would probably change the wallpaper but the cabinets and the and the island are absolutely beautiful to me I love it I don't even mind black appliances we have black appliances I think this kitchen is well put together lots of cabinets upper and lower and a beautiful uh, butcher block type uh, island space enough to put seating on either side as well as the front just an overall nice area now those curtains and the wallpaper give it like a country feel. So I think depending on where I would have this home, it would be appropriate. Um, I could see a nice light, bright color wall in this room just because the cabinets are a bit darker. But I absolutely love this kitchen, love it. I love the color of the cabinets. I love the fact that you have the regular cabinet and then an upper cabinet above it. I love the black countertops. Um, which is a contrast from the Butcher Block Island. I love the fact that all around the island you have either shelving or cabinet space. Just beautiful. The hutch over the stove is nice. For me though, that would have to be um, a ceramic top stove. It just would have to be. My next stove will be ceramic top. Off the kitchen you have your laundry room. You have your back door here. Space for your washer and dryer and storage space. And then you have this wonderful area over here where you have a sink, you have space for uh, uh, shelving, or you have space for additional storage or deep freezer. So really, really lovely. Um, having this big sink is an absolute plus. Absolutely love it. I would probably even put a mirror over that sink just so if I'm going out the front door, coming back in and I need to check myself. But such a huge space um you could create pantry space in here as well and the fact that there's a door that closes um to this area is also a plus because if you have company and you're washing clothes or that room isn't putting together you could absolutely close it off so really nice so far we've seen the living room and the kitchen next to the kitchen you have your dining room area love the fact that they put a chandelier over the table a huge area that table looks so small in that space because you have so much room in here to like do what you want if you want to put a buffet table in here if you want to make it a much bigger table you have space in here and not very often do you see a transom window over the dining room window so what a wonderful, wonderful plus. You had a transom window over the kitchen sink as well. So really, really nice. And you're going to see that thing throughout the Mon Monster Mansion. They have barn doors that can close off the family room, man cave, play area, whatever room this would be for you. Um, I personally love the barn doors. If you don't like a rustic look, consider 
French doors or just having that space open, but really, really lovely. The same color as the cabinets is on this uh, feature wall. You have a fireplace and a mantle here. Really lovely touch. Absolutely love it. I wanted to show you how much space you have on the mantle. If you wanted to extend that, you know, you could get a, get a carpenter to do it. But um, I think the fact that it's even a mantle there is beautiful. I could see a big sectional in this room. They put another ceiling fan in here, which is a plus. Transom windows over the two windows in this room, bringing in even more light. What a lovely area. What a wonderful area. This would be my husband's man cave. And nobody would be allowed in there but Hercules. So this is really lovely. So nice. We'll walk back through the house. If you go back through the dining room, kitchen, and then living room, there's a long hallway right off the front door to the left. And that leads to the additional bedrooms. Absolutely love this long hallway. It just makes the home, um, it's a big home. It's a five bedroom, three bath home. But the fact that the rooms are not like right off the living room, you have this hallway that leads to the rooms is a plus for me. To the left of this long hallway is the first additional bedroom. Absolutely love it. It has carpet in here. It's a nice size room with lots of light coming in through the window. You have a walk-in closet in this room, which is a plus. Just a nice size bedroom for anyone. Y'all know how I feel about these walk-in closets that don't have enough hanging space. So I definitely would have at least one side, a wire rack on at least one side for more space because this closet is long, but it's narrow, right? And that small space is not enough for your, for your items to hang. So make sure you do that before the house leaves a lot. And it, you guys, if you come see this bedroom and purchase it from Wayne Fire Your Homes, make sure you tell them that Christy from Homes and Things sent you because the furniture package will be free if you make a purchase, okay? This is the first additional, this is the first bathroom. Nice size bathroom with a tub and shower combo. I actually like the wallpaper in here. It makes it brighter even so, cause there's not a window in here and the floors are dark. So really love the wallpaper in this room. It's in between um, two bedrooms. So this is your second additional bedroom. Another nice size bedroom. We'll have a look around this bedroom. So this is bedroom number two. Again, this is a five bedroom home. It has three baths and it is just an absolute wonderful layout. You have another um, semi, you have another walk-in closet here, not enough hanging space. Make sure you bring those racks around so you have enough space to hang. But overall, this is a nice size room. All right, so now that we have seen this additional bedroom, we'll move on to the next room. Again, this is a beautiful layout, you guys. For anybody looking for a five bedroom, three bath, this is a beautiful layout. You have your next bedroom. This is bedroom number three here, another nice size bedroom. This home does not disappoint when it comes to the bedrooms. So let's look around this bedroom. You have a standard closet in here which is really lovely and you have a Jack and Jill bathroom. All right, so now that we've had a chance to look around the bedroom, we're gonna take one more look around and then we'll take a look at this Jack and Jill bedroom. So your, your bathroom, excuse me, is off the door to this room. But if you look out into the hallway, you can see the other additional bedrooms. So that's how close they are. 
This bedroom shares a bathroom with the room next to it. Let's take a look at that bathroom. The bathroom has, uh, you have a sink, toilet, and tub and shower combo, just like the other bathroom. Uh, the dimensions of the bathroom are a little different, but it seems to have the same amount of space. Nice size room, enough for two people to share. The great thing about it is two bedrooms will share one bathroom, two bedrooms will share the other, which is an absolute plus walking straight through this is the fourth additional bedroom another nice size bedroom they didn't skimp on any of these bedrooms which is always a plus and you have another standard closet in here All right, so again, we have seen four of the five bedrooms. They did a really great job with this layout. They really did a great job with the size of these bedrooms. I'm really impressed with that. Um, and overall, this is a great house. Absolutely love it. I know that this house is paneled. You can order this house in full drywall. That's really up to you, but this is a really well-built house. So just to give you another idea, the bedrooms, you have two bedrooms and a bathroom on the left, and then you have two bedrooms and a bathroom on the right. So that's just to give you um, an idea of the layout down on this side of the house i just wanted to walk back through and show you that again you have two bedrooms and a bath on either side and in the hallway you have this desk area that has storage space as well so you have six drawers in the desk and two upper cabinets so really lovely um school supplies and extra items could go there people could do their homework in this area just a really nice desk space. So if there's one bedroom that doesn't have a desk, this could be their area. Or this could be your budgeting area. If the kids have their own desk areas in their room, this could be your budgeting area. So really, really lovely. All right, who's ready to go check out the primary bedroom? I'm excited to show it to you guys. The primary is right off the kitchen. And it is a huge area. Absolutely love it. I would put my king size headboard between those two windows. Love it. I absolutely love the size of this room. Huge area for your primary. You could create a sitting area in here or do whatever you like with it absolutely love it you have a closet a walk-in closet in this bedroom and not in the bathroom which is always a plus for those that really don't care for the closet being in the bathroom you have a very long walk-in closet in here i would bring that shelving around the walls just to give me more space i would do it on either wall but this is i'm gonna look at the floor and show you just how long the space is wonderful wonderful walk-in closet in this bedroom okay really lovely and then on the opposite side of the bedroom you have your primary bathroom so as you enter you have your your toilet to the right and then straight ahead you have your walk-in shower huge shower head in there love the tile love the size of that shower You've got additional storage in here, a nice soaker tub, and double sinks and a makeup area. Really lovely. So this is an area that you could close the door and really enjoy your spa area, your area to unwind, take you a nice shower, take you a nice bath, and just relax. Absolutely love it. Love the big window over the tub i could see a lake out that window just a beautiful room 
It's really been a pleasure bringing you this tour. It's been a pleasure coming out here and visiting the good folks at Wayne Fire Homes in Albany, Georgia. Good people out here, you guys. If you're in the area and you want to come check out their homes, make sure you tell them that Christy from Homes and Things sent you. If you purchase, your furniture package will be free for telling them that Christy from Homes and Things were referred you to their lot so i appreciate you guys i hope you enjoyed this tour as much as i love bringing you the tour if you want to inquire about pricing or any other questions regarding this home their information will be down in the description box below okay all right thanks so much for watching we'll see you in the next video